everyone and welcome back to another review with Misty Vapor. We're going to talk about some juice from Tesla Vapor Labs. This is a company right here in Texas and he messaged me a while back and asked me if I would review some juice and send it out to me. I also got these cute little stickers. I will give you their links down in the description. But Homer got in touch with me and asked me, he said, hey, you mind doing a review for us? And I said, sure, send me some juice. So he sent me out the juice. I've had it for a little bit, and I've been kind of vaping on it here and there, you know, kind of getting what I like out of it, you know, my, my way of doing things, as we all know. Misty does things different than most people do. I don't just sit down, open a bottle, and vape it. Okay. So to Homer and Jean, thank you so much for the juice. And we're going to get down to this review. I have here, this one is my absolute favorite. It's already halfway gone. It is called Aristotle. It is three milligram. It's an 80-20. So it's a max VG line. Their juice is max VG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so we're going to put this on here. Smells delicious. Wait till you I tell you what it tastes like. All right. Yummy. Okay. On inhale... I get like a really fruity kind of flavor, like almost like a mixed berry meets like other type fruits. It's kind of like a conglomeration, but then you get this nice like champagne-y kind of flavor in there. And it almost makes you think that you're drinking champagne with natural fruit in it. So it's a really, really good bait. My fruity vapor lovers, you would absolutely love this juice. I was really hoping that they were going to come to, to the American Vapor Convention because I want to meet them in person. And I know that they went to the other convention in Houston and I didn't get to go. So I'm hoping one day we'll actually meet up because I've been friends with Homer now on Facebook for quite a while. And I'm loving this juice. That champagne and was kind of ties it all together in like a pretty little bow. It is delicious. And for our next flavor, okay, I wanted to make sure I get that flavor off of there. For our next flavor, that's the one I just reviewed. We've got Huxley. Yummy, yummy, yummy in my tummy, tummy, tummy. It also smells amazing. Okay. <clears throat> Whew, got too vapory up in this room. Okay. On inhale, you get like a creamy caramel flavor. On exhale, you're getting a, a cram cracker. Now, me personally, I'm not that big into graham cracker. It depends on what flavoring they use. This one's not, it's not bad, but it, it's a little heavy for me. So there's a lot of people out there that like graham cracker vapes, and you would probably love this one. The caramel in it is a nice, rich, creamy caramel, almost like the caramel Worthener's candy with a graham, like a creamy kind of graham cracker taste in the background on XL. Now, it is a good juice. Don't get me wrong. 
I'm just like not super big into graham crackers. That's, I think that's why I don't like cheesecake, maybe. I'm not big on cheesecake flavors. So, but that graham cracker, it, like I said, it's a little bit heavy for me personally, but you all know I tell you, taste is subjective. You may get this and be like, girl, you're crazy. I love these shoes. Or you may be like, you know what? She's kind of right. The graham cracker is a little strong. You graham cracker lovers definitely need to try this juice. And my caramel lovers, you guys should try this juice as well. I urge you guys to all try this juice. It is a well-made juice. It's you, They use USPA, USP grade ingredients. They're VG, they're PG, they're nicotine. Everything is where it needs to be. It is mixed in the Tesla Vapor Lab. That's why they're called Tesla Vapor Labs. And they're right here in Texas. So that's always good because I love, love, love doing reviews for my place that I live. I also like doing reviews for my place back home, which is Florida. I like doing reviews regardless. I just enjoy it. I like getting, I like getting companies word out there and letting people know, look, this is really good juice. You got to try it. Or letting people know on the other hand, dude, this is not good juice in my opinion, or it's not good quality juice. But that is not the case with Tesla Vapor Lab. So to Homer, thank you, darling. And Jean, thank you for sending me out this juice. My juice is three nick, and like I said, it's Max VG. So all you cloud chuckers, cloud chasers, cloud wanting to blow clouds, go get you some. I love to know that I sent you. And we're going to move right along to the next flavor. Last but not least, this one, it's called Nietzsche. I actually had to call Homer and ask him what the name of this flavor was because uh, it's like it spelled all kinds of crazy like and I had no idea what I was vaping on. So for those of you that want to know what Nietzsche is, let's get down to it. I don't want to taste the last flavor on there, so let's burn it off. All right, guys. Nietzsche. Nietzsche is creamy and it has a really, really great orange. And I know that's weird for me to say because I'm not big into orange, a lot of the orange flavorings I've noticed. There's some of them that are just way too citrusy or and like way, way too strong and it's just like overpowering everything else in a juice. But this one isn't like that. I don't know if it's the cream that kind of balances it for me or what, but this is a very awesome, yummy juice. It reminds me kind of of like an orange sickle a little bit, but it doesn't have that ice creamy taste. It's more like a cream and, and a natural orange flavor. Definitely go and check them out. I will put the links in the description and let them know that this girl right here, Misty Vapor, they sent you. And for now, I will see you all back here on the next review. So vape on and vape strong.